this is my um, one year of owning a house, well, and living on my own um, report. Um, you know, I don't really feel comfortable doing it in, you know, my IR, you know, IRL, so I'm going to just... Ah, oh, that's better. Okay, so this is my one year of living alone um, report. Um, I mainly am making this for myself, but I also kind of wanted to share with everyone how I'm doing and I guess what I've been up to over the last year. So I've owned this house for, like it says, a year. Um, I bought it from someone who worked with my dad and and I took about a few weeks to prep um, once I bought it. And, and then I then started living in it. And that's it. I live with my, it's just me and my cat, Tom. And I'll be honest, it's very lonely. Um, I think this is the loneliest I've ever been all my life. Um, I, I go to work every day. I talk to human beings every day. But I come home and the only thing that ever... Um, um, gets affection or attention from me or gives me attention and affection is my cat, Tom. And that's it. Um, and I, I visit my family a lot and it's still, you know, every evening though, mo the majority of the time I am coming home completely alone with no one else. And that's okay. I mean, I don't, yeah. Um, it's, it's good to have a very quiet place, but I'll be honest though, it has affected me a lot. I have been pretty much nonstop every day. I get home, I turn on YouTube, turn on YouTube, check Twitter, check Blue Sky, and that's what I do pretty much all night almost. I'm, I'm usually working on other stuff, but that's what I'm doing. I am always. I always have something in the background because it's just the silence is so loud. And I have to have something. I, I usually have the unsubscribe podcast going. Um, I, I, I have a lot of um, smug Alana going. I have Kirsha going. I have, I have something going a, a VTuber of some kind of a, a IRL person just to make me feel like I'm not at in an empty house. Um, but some positive news though, I have amassed a very large cinnamon roll collection. As you see, this is my full collection right now. I have, this is my most recent one. Up here is my oldest one from Okinawa. Over here is from Daegu. Um, as you know, um, Tokyo, Daegu, and then this one's from a, a coworker over here. Um, so yeah, so my cinema roll collection has grown. I also have now have above me is my, um, princess bride painting. Um, I actually hung that myself and framed it myself. So it looks really cool. Um, convention wise over the whole last year, I've been to, um, a convention local. I've been to dragon con. I went to a convention in Columbus and that's, I got a Greg Griffin, um, signed picture and got a photo with her. That was really cool. And I went to TwitchCon. TwitchCon was a big deal for me. Um, I never had gone to California, even in the first place. And it was a big deal to me. Um, it was really fun. I, it was nice to spend some time with my friends. Um, they were busy, but that's okay. I found some time to do some other cool stuff. I am making a video on that at some point. I don't want to dawn too much on that. Oh, housewise. Um, I've replaced a toilet, which is a video. I have set up, set up and taken down a Christmas tree, which is a video. Um, uh, what else have I done in video? I'm trying to remember what else, I've, what other crazy things I've done on video. Um, if I remember more, I'll, I'll put them up on the screen, I guess. Um, so that's been cool. That's that's been really cool making videos in the house. Um, and 
whenever I make videos in the house, it's mostly with the goal of showing people how to do something or showing people that I've done. Oh, cat door. I've done a cat door, um, for my, for my cat. That was cool. Um, um, what, what are other good things? What are the good things? Um, I have been, I, I had a best friend in high school, um, and also partially through college and we just kind of stopped talking. Um, we had a big, um, they had some life situation happen and they, we just stopped being friends for about three years, cold Turkey. That's it. Just gone. Um, they try to communicate with me a little bit. I was just so mad at them at the time. I didn't talk to them at all. Um, but now I have started to talk to them again. Um, they're my best friend in the world and I hope they don't see this. Um, hope they'll see any of my other videos, honestly, um, because um, I actually have put some references to them in other videos. Um, so yeah, <laughs> um, so that's a good thing that happened. Um, I I one other good thing that happened recently um, that it comes with a bad thing, but that's okay. Um, I I I am a sp sort of split family kind of I have a stepdad and my stepdad is my dad that's the what I, I call him dad because he's my dad basically the I, I, longest person male figure in my life who guess what he's my dad um, but my biological dad um, was at my grandpa's funeral and I as an adult made the decision of well I, I guess I gotta talk to him um, so I started talking to him I got his phone number. Um, he texted me for my birthday. And it's one of those weird things where as an adult, I can decide that kind of stuff. Um, and that was really positive. Um, got some stories from my early life. Um, eventually, he's going to send me stuff um, from my early life that I just neither, neither my mom had. Um, That's kind of cool. Um but that comes with the bad of my papa passed away this year. Uh, my papa who had a lot of faith in me and was the main is the main reason who one of the big reasons who I am. Um the big reason I love science, engineering, and technology is because of him. Um he's my biggest one of my biggest impacts on my life besides my mom and da and mom and dad um stepdad. Um and it's um, and it's just, it's sad that he had, he passed away. Um, he is, he's very missed by me. Um, yeah. What else? What, what other good things happened? Um, I, I've started learning to cook. Um, one year ago, I barely ever cooked. This year I have cooked so many meals. Um, most of those meals I've posted on a friend discord because they're just so much fun to make. Um, cooking is one of the big things, but I don't cook that often anymore. Um, as I've been at this house longer and longer, um, just because of how much time it takes and how much cleaning it takes. As you can see in this picture, that's, that's, those are clothes. Um, that is, those are a pair of pants. Those are my pants. I haven't put them away. My laundry is on a chair over there. I have socks ahead of me. Um, on the on the table that this camera was mounted to, um, I I've been having a hard time cleaning um, in terms of putting stuff away. The house is relatively clean. Um, it just needs um, stuff put away. I don't have an issue where dishes make it into the sink. Dishes are not making it into the dishwasher, and I need to make a better better effort at doing that. Um, Another thing I need to do better is exercise. I I get home, I need to remember my remind myself to take walks. Walks are the biggest thing I haven't been doing enough of. Um, and I hope next year I do a whole lot more walks. Um, I really want to get back into hiking, and the best way to get back into hiking is walking um, just around the neighborhood. And then when you start doing hikes and bigger stuff, it's a whole, whole lot easier if you've been doing those base miles. And I hope to do a lot more of those. Um, another thing um, I need to start doing better is 
just general fitness again again um I don't just not walk I have weights um I have a set of weights I have a, a yoga mat I need to start doing those weights every day I need to start doing push-ups every day um and yeah so I I wish but living alone I have no but I have I live alone I I am only accountable to me that is it the only thing accountable is me um the, the, the standard my house is in is because of me, no one else. And I need to raise that standard for myself and I need to focus and lock in to get better at this. Um, um, yeah. And there's been, um, what other, what are fronts? Um, health wise, I've still the same weight as I've been. I've not gained or lost any weight, thankfully. Um, We'll see next year. Next year when I make this video, we'll see if that's the same. Um, um, what else do I have? Oh, foster cats. I had have so far. I've had two foster cats at my house. I have. Um, I had a mama cat who was give was um fostering from a friend. Um, she was um she got her, and she um, wanted to give her a safe space. Um, that cat is now at the cat cafe. Our local cat cafe now has her, and hopefully she's making people very happy at that cat cafe. Um, but the I have another foster cat right now. Um, his name rhymes with Sam, and he's also going to go to the cat cafe next. Um, so that's a really positive thing for me is having creatures in this house that are not me. Something that I have to take care of. Um, right, Tom? You want to come up on my lap, buddy? Come on. Hop on. Hop on my lap. Okay. Sorry. He's right down there. Um, but yeah. Um, if I think of anything else, um, I guess I can make another video. Or um, I'll be honest. If you're one of my friends and you're watching this and you have concerns for me, that's okay. Um, it's okay to have some concerns for me. I I have concerns for myself sometimes. Um but yeah, I'm I'm very gracious for all my friends who have let me in to um, their communities. I'm very gracious for my family who lets me come over every weekend. Um, my coworkers who are very nice to me. Um, yeah. Um, so yeah, now that's my end of the year report. Um, it's kind of sad, I guess. It's kind of positive in some ways. Um, I am going to make the goal to do better. I need to do better. I can do better. And if I can do better, um, you can do better. And if we're all doing better and we're all encouraging each other, hopefully that means the world might be a better place. Um, I hope everyone has a great evening and um, good night. Good night.